It's been 15 months since Judy Thompson was able to freely walk into her mother's apartment. 97-year-old Florence lives at Oakley Village on Holland, Sylvania. When COVID-19 hit, visits were over. Today, family and friends can come inside, but not without a COVID screening and a scheduled appointment. To me, it just kind of, with everything else going on right now and all the freedoms, it just doesn't make sense that they're continuing to have them so closed off. Mm -hmm. And I'm just kind of looking for answers from the governor. When is this going to change? Thompson says under the current rules, she can pick her mother up and take her off site anytime. I can pick her up. I can take her to the grocery store. I can take her to restaurants. I can bring her here. I can pretty much, we can do anything but I cannot get into her apartment. I can't, if we go to the grocery store, I can't go in with her and take groceries back to her room. Getting inside her apartment to help out comes with restrictions and requires advanced planning. The health orders were lifted today in Ohio, but that does not include nursing homes or assisted living facilities. The COVID-19 guidelines are still in place across the state. Keep in mind that uh, nursing homes uh, are uh, very different environments. Uh, we're caring for some of the most vulnerable uh, people. Even when the restrictions change, private companies can continue to implement their own health and safety rules. With masks off and families free to take loved ones out on the town, Thompson is hopeful big changes are coming soon, including the chance to visit whenever she wants. These people have been isolated for so long. And it's, I mean, just getting, being able to get out and physically see her and give her a hug is great. But it's just, it needs to, I think it's time to open things up for them more.